Tonight, a heartbroken family on the eastern shore mourning their two daughters who were killed in a car crash. According to state police, a pickup slammed into their car while they were stopped for a school bus. News 3 reporter Antoinette Delbell spoke with the girl's aunt and those in the tight-knit community. The Ortiz family shattered after these two sisters were killed in a horrific crash on the eastern shore. 12 year old Nadia Elise dying instantly. Her 15 year old sister Dajer Elise dying from her injuries two days later. I called my brother and when he answered the phone, he just broke in tears and I said, my baby's gone. The crash happened in the town of Weirwood in Northampton County Friday morning. These pictures from that day showing the aftermath, their car, a twisted piece of metal, nearly unrecognizable. The girl's aunt, Migdelia Ortiz, says their mother was driving her three girls to school on Route 13 and came to a complete stop yielding for a stopped school bus. That's when troopers say a man in a truck rear-ended the car, killing the two sisters sitting in the back seat. Ortiz says their 13-year-old sister was in the passenger seat and suffered head trauma. She and her mother were released from the hospital Sunday. Daddy was um, played the trumpet at her school, and Nanny was my model, my fashion girl. Love to wear makeup and daddy didn't let her. Harold Bailey says his granddaughter went to school with the girls and they were close friends. They played in the band together. They were like sisters. Family is wonderful people. I'm very sorry that something like that happened to such wonderful young kids. A GoFundMe for the girls has now raised more than $20,000. The family grateful for all the love and support from the community. They my angel, they, they're not gone there here with us. I just remember all the smile, everything. They were my everything. State police say the investigation is ongoing, adding the driver of that truck was not hurt and could face charges. But that decision will be made by the Commonwealth's attorney. In Northampton County on the Eastern Shore, Antoinette Delville, News 3.